A Pensacola mayoral candidate wants to lessen the penalties for marijuana possession within the city limits, but not all candidates agree with his proposal. News 5's Brian Clerkley is live now in downtown Pensacola. He joins us with more details. Hey, Brian. Hey, Roseanne. Now, J candidate Drew Buchanan wants to make it so if you're driving around the streets of Pensacola and you happen to have under a, a certain amount of marijuana on you, it would be just a ticket, I mean, just a fine. Right now, if you are pulled over or stopped on the street and you happen to have a small amount of marijuana, under 20 grams, you can be issued a $1,000 fine or put into jail for up to a year. Pensacola candidate for mayor Drew Buchanan says he wants to change that. He says low-level marijuana arrests are crowding the jails, and he wants to free up resources for police officers and eventually raise their salaries. He says if a person has under 20 grams of marijuana, it should be a fine. But David Mayo is also running for mayor, and he says he disagrees with Buchanan's stance. There's a minute percentage of arrests that are made strictly on marijuana possession, so it's really not uh, a significant problem by any means. Daniel Pasevich is a medical marijuana patient. He says he suffers from PTSD and picks up products from a marijuana dispensary in town. Yeah, it definitely should not be a fence for someone that's using marijuana to be have to do uh, 30 days at the minimum or any years of probation or anything for a plant that's pretty much harmless. Now, candidate Grover Robinson says it should be up to the residents to decide on this matter, and we could not get in touch with, Laura, with candidate Lawrence Powell for his comment. Live in Pensacola, I'm Brian Clerkley, WKRG News 5, local coverage you can count on.